I'm going to perform a Zercher squat. A Zercher squat was actually invented by a lifter who was in prison, believe it or not. And he didn't have all the tools and everything, didn't have all the bells and whistles to do heavy lifts. So he actually used to perform the lift off the floor. I don't have that type of mobility, so I'm going to do it from the rogue rack, from the straps here with the axle bar. The axle bar is a little bit nicer because the bar is going to go in the crooks of your elbows. If you have a regular bar, it's going to really dig in hard into the crooks of the elbows. The reason why you want to perform a Zercha squat, the whole purpose behind the thing, is that it's going to get your body kind of rounded over. So many people have trouble rounding over in their squats and rounding over in their deadlifts. This is a way to build strength to stay out of that range of motion. So you grab it here and here. You can hook your hands together or just keep them here like this. Try to throw your head up, just come back up. It's a great hip movement. Builds a lot of power out of the hole. And you can see at the very bottom how my back gets slightly rounded over. I'm trying to arch up out of there, but I'm sure it's probably still slightly rounded a little bit. But that's okay because the weights you're gonna use with a Zercher squat are gonna be somewhat limiting anyway. So you're not gonna be able to handle max loads with your back rounded over. <sighs> Zercher squat works a little bit like a front squat where you'll actually feel a lot of work in, the, uh, in your core and in, in your abdominals as well. So that's the Zercher squat. <laughs>